Uh, good morning. I didn't even turn the camera on yet today. Alright. First camera action. Headed for a, a Headed head shave, shave and maybe a beard trip. Yeah, my man Ernie. <laughs> Hey, well, see, here's what's fucked up. I asked him to book me a hair and beard trim. The comments are going to say, why don't you book your own hair and beard trim? Uh, the, the answer is... <laughs> okay, you always know it's a comment. Yeah, I know exactly what you're saying. Say this. And then the answer is because that's why I have an assistant who's yep. also my friend who I pay to help me. I know some of you guys ask what he does in the comment. He works for me and he owns his own business. So now that's cleared up. So I asked him to book me a hair and beard trim and he booked me a head shave and then just wrote in the comments also like a beard trim instead of <laughs> checking out through the menu that has <coughs> head shave and beard trim. I didn't see the comment. And the real clincher I guess is that you build websites. Yeah. So like you know like yeah. copacetic. I'm gonna talk to them about their user interface today. Yeah, well, they're gonna talk to you about your fucking user interface. It's <laughs> your UI is fucking I was going beard and then it would lock it in and then and then head and then it would lock it in. Beard yeah, and, head, and then and if then... you looked at beard and head, it's almost like <laughs> So I'm saying, you're like Windows ninety five, you work excellently in some ways. Try to listen to a goddamn song. <laughs> You're gonna be downloading a fucking few things. There's no media player on this here device, sir. Nope. You ever heard of Rhapsody? <laughs> you have now. I made a few mistakes on the vlog last night. I noticed the uh, yeah. tweet this morning. First, I, yeah, I got the pigeon totally wrong. I don't know why I thought that the pigeon, the purple pigeon was first. So yeah, I got that completely wrong. And I said it was the first, the first SB when I had a conversation on Twitter yesterday about the first four that they released. Four, first four, I know you don't know what I'm talking about. No, the I know first what, four kind colorways. of what you're talking yeah. about. Yeah. That was like 2002 or some shit, but yeah, it's crazy how I, I don't know what the fuck I was thinking yesterday. So. And also, the people who are commenting too, I'm gonna go and address it because people are saying they're like saying I'm a hypocrite because I don't chastise Adidas for doing the same thing that Nike is doing. But Adidas doesn't even have a shoe like the Pigeon. You know what I mean? Like they don't even have a shoe that's that that's even that relative in that time period that they could bring back and people flip the fuck out over. You yeah. know what I'm saying? What are they saying they're bringing back in Adidas? Nothing. They're, they're saying just by them producing a ton of Ultra Boost and like basically rehashing the same models or whatever that it's the same as this. And my argument is they're no way near the same thing. Like even if you like include like a Zebra restock that shit's still in the same damn like fiscal quarter. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like as a business it's the same. It's just like you're just controlling your product or whatever the fuck, you know, or manipulating the market, whatever you want to call it. It's just really strange to me. And I'm all not the even Ultra like. Ultra Boost models, that's a whole different thing because it's just, uh, they're, they're just not general like, releases. Yeah, it's they, just shoes. They don't have, and that's like people's argument is that they don't have history. And that's exactly my argument. Like, the Ultra Boost doesn't, the Ultra Boost is a regular ass shoe. You know what I mean? Like later on down the road, like in 10 years, if we're like nice, they're gonna re-release the nice kicks. I just keep using that as an example. Then we can be like, yeah, this is, I don't like this. You know what I mean? Like, because then it'll be relevant to 2000 and whatever year it came out, 15, yeah. 16. So it's just, I don't know, there's like a disconnect and I'm not mad about it. I just, it's a legitimate, like, I don't feel like I'm getting my point across type thing. Like, no, no, you don't understand. Like <laughs> that, that's not possible, you know? I get it that people call the Ultra Boost an instant classic. I know what y'all are saying, but yeah. It is not yet deemed a classic because we haven't gotten there yet. But my love for the shoe is still strong and will stay strong. Yeah. Just y'all confuse me. I was hoping that I looked over there and the mic wasn't on because that would have fucking been great. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Does your heart just jump? <laughs> I think the deplorables are what they were calling the Republicans. So he, he's saying like, I'm proud of it. Like, I'm like, you want to call me a fucking knife? Like, taking ownership of it. Yeah. Eight mile in themselves. <laughs> the Republicans have eight mile themselves. I think it's Republican. I don't, what are these political Someone sides? in the comments is going to tell you to Google it. They like to tell you to Google things. I don't like to Google things. Yeah, I mean, it's anti-Google. I just, oh, it's here. Yeah, it, you can't miss it. Their branding is huge. I can't go right though. 100% I don't yeah, check. Yeah, Fogo is right there. We're down here every fucking goddamn week. Oh, I can go right then. Okay. What made you think you couldn't go right? I don't fucking know. I don't know where I am. That's the problem. In life, or? Man is out here hoverboarding in his feelers. True. Hoverboarding in my feelers. Yo, yo. What's good, I God? Know. I'm out here in my feelers. I got my hoverboard. Oh, it's this one. Oh, I always how do about this. you not? Well, what are you doing? I always go to, there's two of these, and I always look at the wrong one, and I'm, I almost That is this. the wrong one. The first one is? Yes. 
Oh. No, we never go this way. No public uh, park. All right, you were right for once. <laughs> You're not usually right. Well, that's all right. Today, I'll take it. It's okay, we'll make it in the vlog. <laughs> <It's> <laughs> just fun, kidding, though. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Scene. We've got fire department behind us. We're gonna get in a little closer and check it out, guys. The showroom has caught on fire. We're here for the hot deals. <laughs> we came in last night. And we have all the AIs. Off camera, oh, yeah, you guys says the other AIs. We have all four. These came in a bag, not a box. Just fed out to JD Sports. Oh, shit. When's the last time said they always do it. They also send you this bag. This is my favorite thing. They send you the JD Sports bag as if you need this. Why the fuck would I? Why do I need this? Is it a reverse like the Datamosh? Oh, it's like a black and white Datamosh. Yep, nobody cared about them because they weren't um, SNS. But they're fine. Are they the same? Exact color as. That's my they are. It's like the inside out of it. Look. They're exactly the motherfucking same. And they flipped it. Yeah, they flipped it. That's the inside, and that's the outside of that one. They're the same. If you flip this one on the inside, you get the same shit. Look. Hold that up to it. Holy shit, dude. It's just flipped. Yeah. And this one has a great bottom. So like this one is one of 900 and then this one's a fucking GR. It's a 13 or a 12 and a half. This looks small. Oh, uh, this is a 12 and a half. Uh, this is a US 13. No, no, yeah. this is, a, what? Am I reading it wrong? God damn it. They sent me a 13 and a half. I ordered a 13. Bastards. <laughs> hey, at least. They'll still fit. God damn it, dude. At least you got that bag. Motherfuckers. Well, there you go. All right. Do that later. I'm gonna do it though, dog. Because you still gonna do what? This vegan thing. I want to see how I feel in a month. Oh, I can tell you how you're gonna feel. You've already forgotten how much stuff cameras aren't on. Like your fo your brain fog is is real right now. I know your brain's not operating the way that you want it to. I think it's just clearing out some space. Oh. The there is definitely some space in there, my friend. I'm gonna do this. I gotta do it. I just want to see <laughs> what? how. I just want to see how it feels in 30 days. Why don't you, instead of just going straight vegan, to see how it feels vegetarian. in 30 days? Well, why don't you just like oh, vegetarian? Sure. Why don't you just you yeah, know maybe start with eating healthy throat. for a month? Yeah. You know? Because I can't control myself for thinking through that much. So if I just strictly say vegan mm. and healthy vegan. Okay. Well, the saga continues. Atomoshes. <laughs> Anything, these things are just inside out. This, inside. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's the inside of the shoe. That could be an NMD, maybe it's coming out. Yeah. See, this is an amazing discovery that Ern made today. Well, I showed him today in real life. Yeah. But also, when this shoe came out, we discussed it in detail on the vlog. I missed that one. Really, ex well, for the last 30 minutes, just really excited and mind blown over it. Like picking up every single NMD and going, no way, no, oh, no way, this is crazy. I'm gonna, I'm gonna custom glitch my human races. The human races are solid on the inside. Oh yeah. Homie, homie to homie. I'm just sleeping. Yeah. I'm just resting most. I'm resting with the right skateboard. I'm gonna try my skateboard. So you're ready to go pro in Call of Duty now, huh? Pretty much, dude. Uh, I cannot believe that you fucking beat me with the shovel. Cue highlights, please. <laughs> this is amazing. <laughs> no! Are you fucking serious? I wasn't looking, I was looking at the fucking chat! Oh my god! Hey, let's see the heroics. Oh my fucking god! <laughs> Are you fucking serious? I wasn't even looking at it. Oh my god. <laughs> 
I can't even. Good man. He's so big now. Yes. He just picked it up with the yes. Yes, good man. Good man, Omar. So what's up everybody? Uh, it's a little bit of a shorter day today. I have to uh, get the vlog done because we have a drop tonight, uh, 8 p.m. for the AI. This doesn't look good. Uh, what's up Omar? Boop. AI 002 drops tonight at eight o'clock. So I've got to kind of try and get the vlog done early so I can be prepared for that and be online and answering questions and just dealing with the drop. So uh, I got to go a little bit early, but today, anyway, we're going to talk about two pairs of shoes. So one pair I got that came in yesterday, we saw was the last of the four colors of the AI pack, AI camo NMDs, which look like this here. Whoa, that's not it. Sorry. These are the AI camo. So the AI camo NMD that looks like this finally got that one in. This one came from France. Uh, resell on these. So they obviously dropped dramatically, but let's look. The lowest is $409, the low in my size. And it looks like average. Yeah, the ab the highest price one is size six for 500. So let's say 500 just to be fair, right? So resell around 500 maximum for this pair here. Uh, we've gone through all the NMDs lately. It's just, I mean, NMDs are NMDs by this, at this point. It's really the only thing that changes are the colorways and kind of, you know, the colorways and then how much they limit each pair which creates this crazy hype and people go nuts um resale doesn't always go insane anymore which i'm fine with the shoes when they're about to release or are being released just tend to have a lot of hype around them so specifically these pairs when they were about to release people were going crazy over not as crazy as they used to but still pretty crazy one of 900 pairs of each um and that's you know that's what drives it you know this specific pair there's only 900 pairs of so the reselling is a little bit higher but like I said nowadays it's not that crazy this is black and white camo the real big difference on this one actually I want to get the other camo and see okay so here is the OG glitch camo and this is definitely different so this at first I thought these were the same they're not they are slightly different they might not look that different in the camera but there's more patterning on this one than this one but this is the OG glitch that came out no stripes Super, super sick. This would be the AI glitch camo pack. It's essentially close to the same color, just a little bit darker. It has three stripes and kind of has this cool gray, cool gray toe stripe, uh, but everything else is pretty much the same. Black bricks and then the cool gray sole, which is my favorite part of this particular shoe. AI pack is complete. We haven't looked at the orange and yellow one yet or brown, whatever, but we'll take a look at it tomorrow, I'm sure. So what else released and no shout out to JD Sports for shipping it in a bag and shipping me the wrong size. They're a little bit too big because they sent me a 13 and a half, but this pair dropped over the weekend, I believe. And this has no name really, except it looks just like the Datomosh from SNS. There's really no difference other than the stripes Whoa, these stripes are different. I didn't even notice that. What the fuck? That's crazy. These stripes are like fabric. That's different. Crazy. It's like some, huh, I just discovered this. Um, but yeah, so this is basically a data mosh except it has stripes and it's a different color. But in my opinion, if this shoe dropped and they had said that this was, you know, the midnight gravy and there was only fucking 300 of them, people would be going nuts. But because this had no announcement, nobody cared, nobody hyped it, there was no marketing behind it, it just sits. Which I, again, have absolutely no problem with. The people who have problems with these things are either one, trying to resell the shoe, or two, living way too much through the shoes. Shoes are just like, a thing you know we get shoes and some of us get way too many shoes guilty but they don't like they they don't make they don't they don't make you special you know like they're just they're just shoes and that's the thing like there, there comes some sort of personal taste or like personal identity that comes into buying shoes at some point or anything really and some people will only co-sign what everyone else likes it takes a little bit of again personal style i guess courage in society a little bit of not giving a fuck to rock what you'd like and decide 
for yourself what you like. In my opinion, this is probably one of the hottest NMDs. I think this one is hotter than this one. You know, like, I like this one. I really like the cool gray hits. The Datamash vibe on this one totally sets it off and I, it just looks amazing on feet, I think. This you can still get for retail. You will probably, honestly, be able to get this on sale because really no one's even talking about it. So literally the same exact colorway. These are the same exact colorway, aside from the cool gray stripe, except this one is turned inside out. We discussed this earlier today, and we also, or we also discussed this on the vlog before, but these Datamash pairs are just regular camo PK turned inside out. So that's that's literally what has happened here, as far as I can tell. Um, and the only difference really is brick color. You know, so you got you got gray bricks on this one, black bottom, again reverse knitting, and that's really it. And then there's a pink boost. I don't think you can see it. There's a little pink. See it? Hey. So these sitting. All over the place, probably can find your pair, and I'm kind of glad because this 13 and a half is probably gonna have to go back, just a little too baggy. And then this pair, one of, you know, 900, sold out immediately, being resold, and will resell in the future. I mean, as the future goes on, the reselling these will climb back up a little bit, especially like two or three years from now. I I'm sure you'll see these, you know, go around four or 500 and stay there. But these, who knows, you know what I mean? Like, I guess they could be passed on in a couple of years, they could skyrocket, because that always, that is the recipe for a that is the recipe for a real good resale shoe is for everyone to pass on it. Everyone miss it and then, you know, someone else rocks it, people go nuts. You know, like if Kanye rocked this in indeed tomorrow, people might go nuts. Not, you know, that's just what they do. Those are the two pairs. This is the AI camo NMD. And this is, it doesn't have a name as far as I know. I'm just calling it the Datamash. These came out uh, with another pair that is also olive green and has a pink brick. I didn't really get that pair. I wasn't feeling it too much. This pair I really do like. I really, really like it. So, yeah. So, one you can get for cheap, probably on sale. One's gonna cost you, you know, a car payment. So, choice is yours, I guess. And then some people will, well, this is where people will fight with me. They're like, well, you don't chastise Adidas for this. Like, these three shoes, these three shoes all look the same, Teddy. Like, what the fuck? These are, these are all the same. Like, these are all exactly the same. Well, yes and no. I mean, they are and they aren't. So this isn't the same. It doesn't have any stripes. And it was the first one. This one was an AI pack and it came out just now. And it was the second one. This one is completely different. It's inside out. So I have no problem with this in this timeline. So these both happened within a month of each other. This pair is only a couple of years old, like a year or two old. Like the first one of the first in and If they're still doing this in 10 years, then I'll have a problem with it. If in 10 years they're like, whatever the most popular NMD is, bring it back. We're gonna bring back the NMD. Here it is. We're not gonna make any advancements back. I, I, I would have a problem with it. So it's the same thing. I'm not like trying to beat, I'm not, I'm not hating to hate. It's not like there's no principle behind it. It's just literally, I feel like things get regurgitated for with way too much time in between so um yeah that's just my opinion we don't we don't have to agree so it's all good but uh yeah so those are your pairs no name datamash ai camo and uh yeah so i'm gonna go and i gotta get ready to drop tonight 8 p.m mountain time so by the time this vlog is up the drop should be happening very shortly after or is already taking place so good luck oh it's teddy.com someone must shoot oh it's teddy.com see you guys tomorrow peace